So, back for another VGC guide, and this time we are looking at one of the best Pokemon to ever exist in Salazzle. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna do that again. Some people didn't get the joke with Ditto, so here's the row up. So, yeah, it's definitely a gimmick. Illusion is really cool, because it can catch some people off guard. The only issue with it is that you see that there definitely is a Zoroark somewhere, whether that's on the bench or in the team, and you don't know. So you can catch some people off guard, but they do get to see that there is a Zoroark, so it is a bit of a gimmick. You can catch some people off guard with it, for sure. And the point of it would be to surprise KO with the choice specs. It's too frail, otherwise. That's what makes it somewhat of a gimmick. And Focus Sash would mean it's not strong enough to pick up the surprise KOs. That's the big thing. Like, you want Focus Sash, but you don't want Focus Sash because then you're not making the most of your illusion. You want a huge KO early in the game as a surprise that would swing the momentum in your favor. It's strong enough to be able to do that with the choice specs. It's fast enough to outspeed a Garchomp. That's pretty significant. So you can go for a Terrorblast Fairy into the High Dragons and the Garchomps that you outspeed and get a surprise KO that way because they may not uh, tear it in front of whatever you've illusioned into. So that is something, but it's very frail. So you've got to get a surprise KO, and if you fail in doing that, then Zoroark is not going to be very good because it's going to be Oko'd super easily because of how frail it is. But it definitely can catch some people, and it would be fun when it works.